Hey guys, welcome back to IO. I'm Ron McKenzie Lafergie. With the insane popularity of fidget spinners, we've been bombarded recently with these nifty spinning gadgets. People are going crazy for the things, but some people are going really crazy and spending loads of money. So let's compare a cheap spinner with a designer spinner to see if expensive ones are really worth the money. Starting off with the $5 spinner, we have just a generic spinner from Walmart. This does two things, spin and be colorful. But hey, for a lot of people, that's all you need. It does its job efficiently without any fancy schmancy doodads. Wow, I sound like I'm about 80. It looks like a nice, effective spinner. How could you make one that costs $700? Let's find out. On the other end of the spectrum, we have the Bathgate Artifact Spinner. This bad boy is designed by Chris Bathgate, made by Revolve Makers, and according to them, it, quote, combines sculptural aesthetics and aerospace-grade machining, creating a unique experience. I'll take their word for it, but it does look really sick. It, it kind of reminds me of the Scarab Artifacts in The Mummy, and the shape and colors are just awesome. Now the question is, is it worth it? Personally, even if I did have $700 hanging around, there's no freaking way I'd spend it on a fancy fidget spinner. It seems to me that the cheap ones work just as well and sometimes even better than the more expensive ones. I could go on a vacation with that money, buy an iPhone, buy a laptop, or get something fancier to spin when I'm bored. I'm not judging, everyone has their own priorities, but personally, that wouldn't be my choice to splurge. What do you think? Would you splurge on an expensive spinner or are you happy with the cheap ones? Let me know in the comments section down below. Now it's time for past comments. Daniel S. said, sausages are better with honey. This sounds totally random, and it absolutely is, but it kind of blew my mind. I, I haven't had a chance to try that yet, but it actually sounds delicious. Definitely gonna try. Disciple of Yeshua said, 200 million years of evolution. Wow, guy, you dumb. Believe that BS and you'll be in hell with that pastor. Can't even prove the theory of evolution. Okay, I'm pretty sure this person's joking. If not, please just Google Evidence Revolution and read about it. That's it for today. Hope you guys enjoyed, and if you did, smack that thumbs up button and subscribe to IO for more videos. Let me know in the comments what your ideal fidget spinner would be. Until next time, later taters.